Hello everybody, my name is Kills Record. Welcome to Vernon's Legacy. Now I don't know much about this game, all I know is that it's a survival horror game and I've been playing a lot more horror games and I'm excited to play this game because I've never played it before and I want to know what is the goomagops of this story. So how long is it been? I don't know. It was the time before the war. Well it was a time of innocence. Okay. Before the cloud of death spread over Europe. Alright then. At the time, I could not imagine that I would never see Uncle Vernon again. Fifty-six years old, to die so suddenly, I am at a loss. Well, anybody would be. Somebody died. In the house, it is not the same. It doesn't look the same. The walls appear darker. I remember that house. Oh, yeah, I the see garden it. is there. neglected. Quite uh -huh. different now from how I knew yeah. it. Yeah. Nobody Everything takes care of it. Nobody wants to take care of the house. Very different. Looks so. Looks to be so. Looks to appear so. Yes, it does. It does. It does. Yes, it does. Well, I don't know much about this game. I wanted to uh, to play more horror games, and um, so I'm playing more horror games. Yay! Woo! Yeah! And I want to play more horror mods like Cry of Fear, those kind of mods. And uh, I played a Silent Hill mod, you guys already saw it. Um, probably already saw it by the time you see this video. With this hurry up, yes, yes, the graphics on this game is amazing. Grab the letter from the tape. Let me see. All right, Rob, it would have been my great pleasure to welcome you personally. I must have been six years since the last time, since your last visit to Duncanhoff. The war has left its mark on the house and nothing has been the same since. March 8th, 1920. Damn! We're, we're in the past right now. I'm afraid I cannot welcome you in person today. Given the unfortunate circumstances of late, Robert, please accept my serious condolences for your loss. At the same time, I consider it my duty to inform you that your uncle had changed considerably in the last few months leading up to his death. He was no longer the man you knew. The doctor determined your uncle's time of death as 1.30 a.m. March 3rd, 1920. The cause of death was found to be cardiac arrest. Heart attack. Madeline and I hereby wish to terminate our employment with your family and shall leave the house forthwith. She would likely move to Paris to be with her sister while I seek new pastors in Berlin. You will find the keys to the private rooms on the table. It is time for us to leave. Our taxi is waiting for us at the gate you must your most humble servant Alois Strit matter all right then that's cool all right then you gotta press J all right cool and I can't fucking wait 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 oh yes I'm excited That doesn't make any sense. So I can't pick anything up with this fucking thing. I... Are you serious? <laughs> I'm trying to play with the controller and what I can do right now, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna hop through the wall. That's what I'm gonna do. Look at this. Hop through the wall. Aw, oh, man. It would've been so great with the controller. Wait. Hold on. Bullshit. Bullshit. Yes. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Can I change it? No. Okay. Perfect. Alright. Fair enough. You guys don't see that. Alright, what's in here? What's, what's Gumagop saying? What is Gumagop saying up at this bitch? My dear Robert, believe me, I would have been delighted to see you again and embrace you in my arms. You must have become a real man by now. It has been a very long time indeed. And please forgive me, I have taken away the keys. Why? What was Alois thinking to give you the keys to this house after all that he has witnessed? You cannot stay here. Please listen to me. You must leave at once. This house is not what it used to be back then. It was very different. My dear Robert, please listen to me. For the love of God, do not linger here. Sincerely yours, Madeline DePont. All right. Cracks in the walls. All right. We got the Goomagops. We got. Is that a key? It was right in the open too. 
All right, I. What is that key? A simple key. All right. Really? Really now? Really now? Really now? I gotta press I again. Don't don't do that to me, you stupid game. Don't fuck with me. Don't fucking with me. No fucking with me. Nothing in these dingma boobs. Nothing in these dingma boobs. Alrighty then. Whoa. I could have sworn I saw something. Alright, I don't like these first person horror games. Not that I don't like them. I, I, I don't like how they sound. They scare the shit out of me. And all oh, this jazz. Broken key in the lock. This broken key. No, it just doesn't open. Oh. Oh. See something on the floor. It is a screwdriver. I found the screwdriver. I'm just gonna talk as loud as possible because I'm scared of shit. Nothing better pop out of me. I swear. Ooh. Not going through the dark hallway. Games tell me not to go through dark hallways. Okay, that sounded very, very violent. That also sounded very violent. Just gonna go upstairs then. What is upstairs? Too dark. I must get the lights work. You are very spooky, man. <laughs> Alright. What the fuck? Screwdriver, I can really use that. For what? Nice band. Oh. Oh. A fuse. A fuse. Goddamn. Alright, dear Mary, I am so happy to hear that you were hired at the main post office in Paris. Hundreds may have applied for the position with the Monsieur Maru. Hope I said that right. I am enjoyed. I have ah, la, 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 la. I am overjoyed. Write to me as soon. Write to me soon how you like your new workplace and whether you have found I already found a room. If you are still looking for Adobe uh Bodhi uh sorry. <laughs> Perhaps you can check with uh, Monsieur Bonnet. Monsieur Bonnet, he is a friend of Master Vernon. He lives in the Rue du Sumerard <laughs> and will certainly be able to help you. I received a letter from your parents today. They are already looking for helping hands for the Almond Corp. Oh man, the almonds have corporations and shit. They're about to fucking army it up and whatnot. I would be help happy to spend a few days with you right now there right now regrettably I am very busy at the moment Robert is arriving tomorrow you know the nephew of our employer he always spends part of the summers oh 1914 I see okay the nephew of our employee he always spends part of the summer holidays at Duncan Hoff knowing him he will probably turn the whole house upside down <laughs> last year he even set master Vernon's laboratory on father oh shit oh laboratory Hmm. So maybe there's not ghosts in here. Nearly, re nearly reducing the house to ashes. His uncle seems thrilled that the boy dabbles in science, but where is the science in that? The whole laboratory was in flames, and Master Vernon lets him off without even a slap on the wrist, just like that. My dear Mary, I end, I end for the for today, and send you lots of hugs. Write me soon and tell me what is happening in Paris. Your lovely sister. Madeline. P.S. Alois forgot to bring stamps from Metz. I even wrote him a special reminder. Sometimes he thinks he forgets to buy things for me on purpose. Yeah, he never seems to forget his pipe ta tobacco. Hence, this letter will reach you with some delay. With some delay! So, I deduct, my dear Watson, that there is... Uh, whoa, 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 what part of the game? Okay, you can. Just gonna, just gonna. Oh, okay. I guess I have to go to the dark, gloomy hallway. Oh.
Do I have to go in there? Are you serious? All right, fine. This is gonna hold this. It's gonna protect me. Okay, there's nine back there. All right. Fucking assholes. Maybe there's a fuse in here. Fuse. Oh, wait, 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 wait. The broken key, right? Okay, hold on. I'm writing to you today because I have, I could use a handyman around the house. As you know, I work at the manor of Master Vernon. The house, 1914, is simply too large for me to do all the work myself. And some things are best left to an expert. We have a boiler in the basement, a modern device used to water heating and steam generation. For water heating and steam generation. I suspect it is leading, leaking at, on the bottom. I need you to have a look at it. You know Master Vernon is not stingy when it comes to payment. Maybe we can meet in Mets next Friday and discuss the details. I have some shipping to do in town anyhow, mostly for our cook. Madeline, she keeps writing me these long shopping lists. I believe she does not even need half the things on the list. Yes, she makes a fuss every time I forget to bring something. Alois. 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 All right, I'm gonna check all the shipping. I mean, shipping. Look at me. All right, I don't know what room this is. One thirty, March nineteen twenty. All right. Uh, hmm. Now, I hate when it does it. Oh, you fucking motherfucker. Okay, so little bit bitch. One thirty. No. Okay. I know, I know, can, can you not? Mm. Oh, wait, 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 wait a second. I'm supposed to use it, I'm so sorry guys, I, I'm an idiot. I, I got you right now. It is hard to believe that it closed the post office in Paris, but in 1914. But it is probably for the better. And once the dust settles, I am confident you can start working there again. I am quite sure that the situation will calm down soon. Everyone here says so. Right now, I'm just happy to know that you are safe. And mercifully. Have you paid a visit to our parents on the weekend? Sadly, I will not be able to visit mother and father in November as planned. As you know, the border crossing are temporary closed. I think in 1914, around there, the World War One was going on. I'm not too sure about that, but I know World War One was around the the 10 or the 20s. Um, I'm not too sure. I know a lot about World War Two. I just I don't know a lot about World War One. I. I will just wait a few weeks before I can take a few days off. Surely everything will go back to normal, and the borders will be reopened soon. And look forward. I look forward to see you again. <sighs> Sorry. Warm, warm hugs, Madeline. Alois failed to buy stamps again, but this time he was not at fault. The road to Metz is only open to military transports at this time. Besides, today is his birthday. I should try to say something nice to him instead. See? Why is it so gloomy? 
Oh, oh, alright. 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 I have not left the house in probably a year. Even Alois, Master Vernon visit the city only rarely. It is simply too dear. Thank God we have enough supplies in the house and veg vegetable and the vegetable patch in the garden. When I lie in bed at night, I can hear the thunder of cannons in the distance. The fighting and death is happening right on our doorstep. I knew it. I got goosebumps when I think about it. Master Vernon is trying his best to ease the workload for Alois and me, for which I am grateful for it to him. I will not abandon Master Vernon, however difficult the present situation may be. Warm hugs, Madeline. See, I knew it. I knew World War II was happening around those era, that era. It was, it was very, very dark time, very dark time, very. Oh, oh, November. Alois. Oh, his birthday is. All right, I got zero five oh three, baby. Zero five zero zero three. Zero five. Where the fuck I got zero five? Did he really put his birthday? That's, that's, that's just stupid. No, he did not. He did not put his birthday. Okay, I'm pressing E instead of fucking W. Wait, is it W? Yes, yeah, W. <laughs> Alright, Alois. 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 Wait, why is that one three? What? Oh, oh, the October 3rd. What the fuck is October 3rd? I knew it. So it should be 003. Oh, stupid. 00053. What the fuck is wrong with me? I'm 003. I'm right. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Oh, my goodness. I should be right. Wait, 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 wait. I'm, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. It should be zero. It should be five, zero, three. It's the mom. Tell me. You're telling me! What is it then? Five, three! Five, three! When you put a date, you put the fucking month five, and then you put the fucking three, and then you put the year. <sighs> Wait, was it six? Oh, my ass. My brain! Maybe that's not it. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm wrong. I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm looking through my notes. I'm looking through my notes. All right. Third. How about 314? 314. 314. 314. 314. It has to be 314. It has to be 314. My life, my life, my life, my life, my life, my life. I did it, cause I am a smarty pants. Lights are now on. Aha, yes, may it be light. So I spent a lot of time looking around. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna keep going because that wasn't, I guess, enough. Robin left two days ago. It is already more quiet in the house, and Madeline can breathe freely again. The boy has kept my cook constantly on her toes. The good lady worries too much about him. If he is gone for five minutes, she immediately suspects the worth. However, she is right on one point. I have to pick up the entrance. I have to brick up the entrance to the tunnel of the garden. The, the tunnel leads to the old vaults under the house. And as an 
irresistible allure to a lad of his age. If he goes down there, God knows what will happen. And that was July 26, 1914. August 12, 1914, the newspapers are calling for a general mobilization. Germany declared war on Russia yesterday. No one would have thought it possible just a month ago of that conflict will be resolved. Well, baby girl. <gasps> Rough outside. I hear the thunder. Hear the thunder. The thunder. Oh, it's open. Oh, don't tell me I have to look through that. Thank God. Maybe because I'm higher up, that I can hear it perfectly. The boom, 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 boom. It's quiet. Two. Oh, oh. oh. Okay. Master Vernon is not the in the best of spirits. He has changed so much in the recent months. Now that the war is over, life is slowly getting back to normal everywhere. However, the war has left a permanent dark cloud on Duncanhoff Manor, which is getting thicker with each passing day. Master Vernon has not eaten with us in the kitchen for several weeks. I only see him rarely, usually when he's on his way to the vaults beneath the house. Master Vernon, when he... Wait, what? Has always treated... Alois and me with kindness. We adore the war together. He, it has created a bond between us like no other. But now he is reclusive and keeps a distance. His appearance has changed beyond recognition. As though he had aged very rapidly, even though he is only 56, I wish I could help him. Marry, but I... Marry. I'll help him marry. But I do not even know what... Uh, what... Uh, ails him, sorry. It is the house, the vaults in the basement that made him like this. Warm hugs, Madeline. I should start reading it like a real fucking letter. Is it for this door? It is. Oh. Did I have to get quiet? Why did I need a key for this room? Oh, no, no, no. Cabinet! Give me something, give me something. Getting out, getting out, getting out. That's the creepiest shit! You're not keep put no! Fucking old school bathrooms and shit. Fuck you! Protect me! Shh. Okay, want to see what happens right now in the next episode of Jack Mosey? No. Um, but I've been running through this shit for like 30 minutes or so. So I'm going to stop it here and I'm going to play it some more. But I've, I'm just going to stop it here, damn it. Anywho. Let me just pick this up. I'm picking it up. You can't do that about it! Back the fuck up! It's gonna close this. I'm not scared of amnesia, but I'm terrified of this. And <laughs> thanks a lot for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. Every every view, every subscriber, every comment really is awesome. Guys, comments, like, subscribe. You know, if you guys really like my comment, you guys can subscribe. You don't have to subscribe, but please like the video. Every like helps get more people to enjoy my stupidness. 
But anyways, thanks a lot for watching, guys. And as always, I'll see you guys on the next Vernon Legacy video. And have a good one. Protect me!